Welcome to VM810, Introduction to Food Safety and Professional Development. This course, taught fully online for the first time in fall 2013, was designed for incoming students in their first semester of the online Master of Science in Food Safety degree program. The course was originally designed in a blended format when the program was founded. Students would come to the MSU campus for six to ten days for a series of expert lectures on a broad range of food safety topics. They also spent a good deal of their time networking with faculty, staff, and fellow students. Tasked with program growth, we needed to create a new version of VM810 that could be taught fully if online asking, and therefore remove the requirement for our students to, to come safety, to campus during the program. This meant translating the on-campus academic study, material into an online format using technologies such as Adobe outbreaks. Presenter. But mainly, it meant figuring out how to recreate the powerful and dynamic networking aspect of the course that happened between students, program staff, faculty, and the campus itself. We began with a focus on the course structure. How could we make the class well organized and easy to navigate, especially for our students who are mostly working professionals? Since we designed the course as the first requirement in the curriculum, what tools could we create in D2L that would orient students, many of whom have been out of school for some time, to the online environment and to our program culture? We started with a clear structure that organized the course into weekly modules. Each module would contain content of the three major academic elements, MSU Toolbox, Hot Topics, and Leadership. Further, we added a Getting Started module in the week before the semester officially started. The content focused on orienting students to the technology they would need for the program, specific tips for using D2L, a separate social media group related to the course, and a request to update their D2L profile. To create an online community, we focused on various tools and methods that would connect students to one another as well as to the program staff and faculty. In the People Moment widget on the course homepage, we feature core faculty and members of our advisory council in two-minute videos showcasing their research or history of involvement in the program, as well as the specific courses in which they are involved. Science and Food Safety Program and congratulate you for wanting to be a part of a system that helps to make the food we eat safe and nutritious. A three-minute video was made highlighting the core program staff and their responsibilities filmed in various locations around the MSU campus. Welcome to VMA 10. My name is Julie Funk and I'm the director of the online Master of Science and Food Safety. Hi everybody, I'm Peggy. You all know me as the queen of email and the person that helped you through the admissions process here at MSU. We requested short videos from a handful of our stellar alumni, asking them to share advice for new students, how to leverage the degree in the work environment, and or ways to connect with fellow students and the campus in an online platform. Hi, my name is Lisa Robinson and I am an alumni of the Michigan State University Online Food Safety Program. I could talk for hours about the program, but they only gave me a couple of minutes, so here's three points that I would share with you. Another community building element that we added to the course was a closed private Facebook group. In the first week, students were prompted with an introduction assignment. Across the globe, we found students immediately connecting through similar work history or shared geography and interests. They began posting pictures and comments on one another's introductions that showcased early signs of community connection. This group served to provide a venue for students to ask questions about the course technology and content, and we often found them answering one another's requests in an informal peer-to-peer -peer learning environment. To enhance a connection to the MSU campus for students who usually never make it to East Lansing, we developed assignments in the MSU toolbox that detailed issues related to academic orientation and MSU resources. We also incorporated introductions to MSU icons and trivia. These modules were organized to include lectures and assignments about the enrollment process or creating an academic plan, for example, Short video tutorials were created to explain the library the system and how to access you important resources and materials. Information. The section labeled library. Video clips were also inserted highlighting MSU icons like State Beaumont University Tower, Spartan Stadium, Skyline. and the Eli and Edith Road Art Museum. Some of the most popular trivia assignments for students have been a behind-the-scenes look at the MSU Dairy Store and various community projects that MSU has created. Students have also greatly enjoyed an assignment to purchase Spartan gear with a small gift certificate we provide them. They are then asked to post a photo of themselves in the course Dropbox or the Facebook group. 
Similarly, students have an extra credit opportunity to record themselves singing the MSU oh, fight song in the MSU Caesar spirit next team is semester. weakening. We're going to win this game. Fight, fight, rock team, fight. Big to MSU. We also added program tweets to the course homepage so students can follow how our program interacts with the larger food safety community. As we move through our second offering of this course, we have found that while it has been relatively easy to duplicate and even enhance the students' topical lecture and leadership experiences, they have responded with surprising enthusiasm to our efforts to build peer networking and Spartan community through this online experience.